Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, um, sorry it's been so long once again. I have a massive, massive haul for you guys. And this is going to be kind of a special haul because everything, pretty much almost everything is pink. So hopefully you guys enjoy this if you're into, you know, extra girly, all pink hauls from like Walmart, TJ Maxx, Target, Ross, Walmart. This is probably going to be somewhat of a long haul, so if you guys want to grab a snack or something like that, get cozy with me and I'll share with you guys what I found. And honestly, this has been very accumulative. I've been collecting this stuff pretty much since the start of quarantine. Hopefully you can forgive the lighting. I know it's not the greatest either, but hopefully you, you guys will be able to see the products okay. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. I think I'm going to go ahead and start with Bath and Body Works. That is another store that I did mention I went to, but Bath and Body Works, I decided to shop the semi-annual sale, which honestly, I was a little disappointed this year because I was hoping to find some hand soaps and they didn't really have any, at least at my store, by the time I went. I think it was like around the 6th, January 6th that I went to my store. So this was like, you know, 10 or 11 days after the sale started, so I could have missed out on the soaps, but they didn't have any soaps as part of the semi-annual sale, so I didn't get any hand soaps, but of course I didn't leave the store empty-handed. I wanted to include these items because they are included in the sale right now, but the first thing I have here is a little pocket back holder, and it's just this little fuzzy pink cat. Hopefully you guys can tell that it's pink, but she's got the cute little eyelashes and the whiskers, and then... The pocket back just you know slides in the bottom here um, so I thought this was so cute so these I, th I think that she is like at my store she was 50% off and she's got a little tail too it's so cute um, and then I got a couple of sprays the first one like I said I've had this one for a little while now this is the first time I've ever seen it and I thought it smelled really good but this is included in the sale right now they have like a $4.95 um, select body care sale sale right now so this is one of the scents that isn't included in that sale this is sweet whiskey and i love the packaging with the pink and the gold stars of course um and if you are wondering the fragrance notes of this are golden amber vanilla infused whiskey and sweet apple blossom so this just smells so good to me it has like a campfirey smell if that makes any sense it's kind of like a smoky vanilla it smells really good it's really warm it's almost kind of like if you like the uh, vanilla bean noel i think you'll really like the sweet whiskey so that's one of the first scents that i picked up another one of the scents that was on sale for 4.95 was the pink cashmere and like i said everything in this haul is going to be pink so if you guys love pink then just keep watching if you don't like pink this video is not for you so just warning you now and this doesn't say the notes on it I do have also grabbed the shower gel in this scent which is let's see pink jasmine petals creamy sandalwood white amber and cashmere musk so I got the shower gel the spray and I also went ahead and got the body cream yeah ultra shea body cream so I just love the packaging pink packaging of course these were each $4.95. And then another scent I picked up, I already had the body spray of this, and honestly, I don't think they had anything but um, the body cream in this scent at my store, but this is the Pink Coconut Calypso. And the scents of this one are Coconut Water, Seaside Freesia, Sunkissed Lily, and Apple, and Driftwood. So like I said, I had picked up the scent to this when they had like their $5 body spray sale online like months and months ago. I had picked up the spray, so I went ahead and picked up the body cream. Um, and then I picked up just one of the body lotions. Um, I usually don't typically go for this kind of lotion. I normally like the body creams, but this is the only item that they had in this scent. This is the strawberry pound cake. This is the only item and they only had a handful of these lotions in the scent so I just went ahead and grabbed this it smells so good oh, and of course the pink packaging and I do already have the body spray of this as well and like I said they didn't have the shower gel <clears throat> 
or anything else but I had to grab at least one of these and I did pick up one candle this was 50% off this was the very last one I can't believe I scored this because it was the last one sitting there and I had I had wanted this candle during the candle sale but I had you know I didn't make it to the sale but anyway I was so happy that they had just one of these left and I'm gonna save it for next year of course but this is the pink fairy gumdrop and it's the really pretty like Christmas packaging of course it's the kind that you can see through that like um, when once the candle burns down you can see the flames burning behind the picture so I think that's gonna look really cute so hopefully you guys can see once again I'm sorry about my lighting but those were all the pink goodies that I had picked up from Bath and Body Works I'll go ahead and show you what I picked up at Walmart recently um, so first just a couple of random items um, I've been seeing a lot of like shower related TikToks like um, shower what am I call, what am I looking for uh, little, 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 routines shower routines and I've seen a lot of girls use baby oil to either shave with or to like put on while they're still in the shower and that's just kind of rinse off the excess so I wanted to try that out I have really dry skin um, so I just got this nice big pink bottle of baby oil to give that a try this was like four something um, at Walmart I've been seeing a lot of girls using I think it's the Fiji scent from Old Spice but I came across this one it's the Oasis and it has vanilla notes um, I don't know if this is new or not but I don't remember ever seeing this before but yeah it's called Oasis and the only thing I don't like is it's gel usually I like the like white solids but it smells really good. It still smells nice and mealy, but it has kind of like that sweet vanilla scent to it as well. So, I don't know. It smells pretty good, so I'm going to give that a try. It's not pink, but I figured I'd go ahead and share that with you as well. Okay, so next thing I picked up from Walmart is a pair of leggings. And I was so happy that they still had my size left in these. I think this was the last pair they had, and they just happened to be my size. Um, these are the... Um, no boundaries high-rise leggings these are the 698 um, kind and I got the size these are a 2XL honestly an extra large fits me fine but the 2XL you know they're just a little more you know a little more roomy but anyway this is the pattern it's just this pink camo really cute and I actually really love these leggings um, the 698 ones from Walmart because they're so soft they almost feel like um like the LuLaRoe ones or what's that other brand I can't think of Lululemon something like that I don't know but they're really nice leggings and I have a ton of these leggings but, but yeah I thought these were really pretty and I just of course loved the pink camo some pajama sets I found pajama I never say pajama some pajamas I found um, I came across this set, which was actually from Christmas, so these were on clearance for $7. They were originally $11.88, but see, I got them for $7. Um, and they are these pink Friends pajama pants. So, if you can see, it says, how you doing, pivot, Ross. It's got, like, coffee cups, umbrellas, the frame, and they're pink. Hopefully, you guys can tell. The background is pink, but... Yeah, I thought these were so cute, and for $7, you know, you can't beat them. Okay, another set of pajamas, because you can never have too many pajamas. And they are also another Friends set of pajamas. But I have the matching shirt to go with these pants. Um, and the pants I'll show you first. These are also pink. <laughs> um, and these were $14.87 for the pants. They just look like this. They have, like, the mint colored, or, like, teal and yellow colored kind of like plaid on there and they just say friends all over it and their drawstring um the bottom is kind of like you know bunched at the bottom um and then the shirt was $9.97 and it just looks like this it says how you doing and I thought it was really cute with the pink and the colored um like sleeves and that kind of thing and I think I said this was $9.87 so Yes, gotta love comfy PJs and gotta love pink 
friends PJs. <laughs> okay, one more clothing item I found at Walmart is, I think this is, yeah, this actually says sleepwear, but I don't know. I, I honestly got this in mind to like wear it in public. <laughs> I don't know if I'd be able to sleep in this. It might be a little too warm, but anyway, it's just like this fleece pullover. I hope you guys can tell. It's a nice, pretty blush, like pale pink. Um, and this was on clearance for, that's weird. It says was $12.73, even though it says $9.73 here. It says it was $12.73, but anyway, I paid $7 for it, so. And they had other colors as well. I believe they had, like, um, a, a brown one that kind of looked like a teddy bear, like, you know, brown pullover. They had black. I believe they had gray. And they also had some different pants as well, but they didn't have any that really matched um, this pink one, so I didn't get any pants. Okay, some kind of random things I picked up from Walmart. These just caught my eye, of course, because of the pink packaging, but we also um, use these. Well, we like to have these on hand, but these are, I guess, from the brand Mighty Good, and they are Wipe That Tush 50 Flushable Wipes. You see, it's a three pack here, 50 um, in each pack. These were $5.99. Um, I've never heard of this brand. I've never seen this before, but I figured, you know, I'd give them a try. And like I said, the pink packaging caught my eye and we use these anyway. So figured I'd try them out. A few more things from Walmart. Um, I picked up this body wash. This one caught my eye, of course, because of the pink packaging. And then I had to smell it. Um, the scent is Rose Vanilla. It's from Soft Soap. It's a uh, Lustrous Glow Exfoliating Body Wash. Um, that's what the packaging looks like, if you guys can see. Um, and normally I don't like rose scented things or florally scented things, but since, you know, the packaging was so pretty and it's rose and vanilla, I was like, alright, let me give it a sniff. It actually smells really nice. It does have that rose scent to it, but it also has the really sweet, like, vanilla scent to it as well. So it's not, like, overpowering, like, florals. And this was, like, $3.97. One more random thing from Walmart. And this isn't pink, but I'm just going to go ahead and throw this in here anyway since we're, we're already on Walmart. But I was um, on the hunt for this because I happened to see this in somebody else's haul video, I believe. And I've been wanting one of these. This is the Nostalgia brand. Nostalgia? Nostalgia brand and this is the my mini seven egg cooker and this is the teal color so this is like pretty much the main like pop of color that I have in my kitchen other than pink I do have a little bit of pink here and there but mainly just this teal color um, so I thought this would really come in handy I love hard-boiled eggs I love egg salad you can do omelets and scrambled eggs you can do pot stickers you can steam vegetables um, so yeah, and they did have a few other colors of this. I don't believe they had a pink in this egg cooker. They did have like mini waffle irons and stuff like that that they did have a pink in. But yeah, I was happy to find the teal one of this. Oh, and this was um, $8.96, I believe. So nine bucks for this, not bad at all. Okay, last couple things I have from Walmart are these giant bins. Hopefully I can get these in frame to show you guys. But they are these um, giant 18 gallon uh, Sterilite like tote tote you know storage totes but they're in this beautiful pink color here let me see if I can scooch, scooch this back a little bit see they're these giant totes this really pretty pink color but yeah I picked up two of these um I wanted to get these while they had them. I don't really have a use for them at the moment, but I wanted to get them while they had, you know, this color. These were $4.98 each. Like I said, they're 18 gallon totes, so they're very nice size um, totes. You can use these for like holiday decorations. I had to get them while they had the pink color because that's not a color that they have too often. So when I see it, I like to get it. Okay, so next I just have a handful of things, like three things, from Five Below, all pink, of course. Um, the first thing I have is this adorable cat shower speaker. Um, it's a wireless water resistant speaker. 
speaker and I think I saw Krista Brusso haul this so I was like I have to go find that here's what it looks like it's super cute um, it looks like it's got a suction cup yes yeah, so strong suction mount so it looks like it you know just suction cups to your um, shower tile and this was five dollars they had I think a unicorn one and something else but of course you know I had to get the pink cat last two things I grabbed from five below I grabbed a couple of Freeman products this first one is the rejuvenating cucumber and pink salt clay mask this is supposed to instantly detox and clear pores for renewed skin um, and it's for all skin types looks like this it's pale pink like almost kind of peachy corally pink packaging so I had you know had to add it to the collection but the next item I have and I've never seen this before I have seen this one in other places like Walmart and stuff like that but I've never seen this product this is actually a body product from Freeman and this is the strawberry milk hydrating body sugar scrub cute pink packaging and these were each four dollars I don't know what's with me lately I've always loved pink and I've always like bought certain like pink products but here lately I'm just like everything has to be pink everything like even down to freaking push wipes and <laughs> they have to be pink it just it makes me happy okay just, it makes me happy makes me want to use the products and yeah I just that's my story and I'm sticking to it a few things from Target like a few like totally random things um, first, actually, I went in there looking for these. These are actually in the dollar spot, and I think these just came out um, for like the springtime. But these are bag handles, um, and they're only a dollar each. So I got a pink one, and I got one for me, of course, one for my boyfriend. So we got like a his and hers thing going on here. But I didn't even show you guys like really how it works. But you just push this button here, and then this opens up, and then you just kind of loop your bags into it. So you're just carrying this one handle instead of, you know, like 10 different bags. Um, and it holds up to 11 pounds. And then the, just the last random thing I picked up. I think this is it. I, I have stuff everywhere. Um, I came across this little, like, zipper pouch. Um, just this little pink zippered pouch. It says, all charged up. Um, it's a really pale pink with the gray, like, um, piping and you just open it up and it's got like this little mesh pocket here and it also has this little piece here that velcros that you can like um you know make like separate little uh spaces if you wanted to um and this was three dollars in the dollar spot and the reason i got this is because <coughs> i still have my nintendo ds <laughs> um this is my old case and as you can see it's kind of like you know overflowing hello kitty case i think i got this hello kitty case at like five below back in the day years and years ago but here's my ds case um i wanted to yeah this is gonna work actually <laughs> this is gonna work really good actually but i wanted to um have enough space in here for my ds and like all of my games because this isn't even all of my games in here like i have this little case here that has some games i have this old what is this game boy yeah game boy advance game because this if you guys have a nintendo ds you guys know that these fit in in here anyway so this has like plenty of room for like my ds and my games and all my little like you know little components and whatnot so i thought that was really cute okay so the next store i have some pink items from is ross um, and I went in there actually looking for these specifically and at the time they only had these smaller packs um, these are the Juicy Couture hand sanitizing wipes so I found these super cute pink packaging I got two packs of these these were each $3.99 so like I said I went in looking for these but they only had these small packages 50, 50 wipes per pack but then I went in a few days later and found the nice big canisters and these are each a hundred wipes each and these are $5.99 each 
So I had to get the super cute packaging. See, like even down to hand sanitizing wipes, like how cute is this packaging? It just makes you want to use it. And if you were to like just leave it sitting out, it still looks cute. It doesn't look like a cleaning product or, you know, that sort of thing. So, and these are actually really nice wipes. They are unscented. So, of course, when you first pull one out and use it, it's very strongly, um, you know, alcohol scented, of course. But once that dries, um, you're left with, your hands feel nice and clean after using these. I really like that about these. They feel nice and clean, nice and sanitized. Um, they don't feel sticky or anything like that. And they don't leave a scent. So, if you guys are like, you know, easily irritated by <clears throat> heavily scented things you guys will really like these next random thing I picked up these were actually on clearance for a dollar ninety nine originally two ninety nine I think um, but these are just some vintage plates uh, nine inch plates but they're pink and I don't know if you guys can see like the detailing around the edges but they're super cute um, and these are they're not microwave or dishwasher safe which kind of sucks um, it says they are disposable um, but I'm going to, I mean, I'll probably, you know, hang on to these and hand wash them a few times before, you know, get rid, getting rid of them. Okay, and then the last thing from Ross is this Too Faced uh, Rich and Dazzling High Shine Sparkling Lip Gloss. And this is in the color Net Worth. So it's like a nudie shade. Um, and I didn't even get to, this was in like a um, locked case when I got it. So I didn't even get to look at the color, but that is actually really pretty, so... I figured it was going to be like a nude color and I don't have any of these uh, lip glosses I just I love that packaging it's so pretty but I cannot pay the original price tag I think of like $22 for one of these like that's crazy um, 10 was almost pushing it for me you guys like <laughs> this is $10 at Ross so uh, I had to have at least one the rest of the stuff I have for this video for this haul is going to be all TJ Maxx. First item here I've already been using, and you'll see why in a second, but this was $14.99 at TJ Maxx, um, and it is from the brand Jenna Loves Collection. It is a printed throw, just an oversized throw, 50 by 70. Here's what it looks like, you guys. It says meow all over it, got cat ears and whiskers. How cute is that? This is really pale pink, super soft. It is a decent size, but yeah, I had to get this. And the next thing I have, this was actually on clearance, and I used, I think I had a $10 rewards coupon that I used toward it, so this was originally $24.99. Um, it was on clearance for $16, and then I used my $10 uh, rewards, of course, so it was like $6, but anyway. It's just this little pink furry throw rug. Hopefully you guys can like see the length. It's just kind of a short one. Um, it says 29 by 42 is, is the length. So I just thought that was super cute. It's kind of an odd shape, but for pretty much $6, I could not pass that up. I've always I've been really wanting like a fuzzy pink rug like that. Next thing, this isn't going to go in any like order, I'm just going to pull things out of the bags and show them as we go. Um, the first thing I have here is a blow dry volumizer and I'm not really sure why I got this because I don't blow dry my hair, um, but it does say before blow drying or heat setting so I guess you can use this before straightening your hair. Um, but this is the Miracle 7 for Heavenly Hair Blow Dry Volumizer. This is $5.99. Of course, the super cute pink packaging. Like I said, everything is pink. Non-drying, non-brittle formula. Volumizes, volumizes hair shaft. Creates lift at root. Humidity resistant. No buildup. Non-sticky. And adds shine. Alright, next item I came across um, recently. I just found this the other day, actually, and I was super excited. But this is the Pretty Vulgar Lock It In Makeup Setting Spray. And just, of course, the packaging alone, I had to have it for the packaging alone. This was $9.99. And can you guys believe that this is $50 on Sephora's website? I think it's on sale right now, but it's originally $50 for this little ass bottle. I mean, the bottle is adorable, don't get me wrong. It's pink, 
you guys can't tell. This, um, unfortunately, is just for show because you just you take this whole cap off and then it just sprays out right here. But it's still super cute. Um, but what I like is that you can, you know, unscrew this and I definitely planned to keep the bottle and reuse it once it's empty. Oh, I just found one random thing from Walmart I forgot to show you, but it's just this um, pink duct tape. I just, I came across this and it caught my eye. I thought it was super cute. I've never seen, um, you know, a masking tape in this color before. So I just, you know, I grabbed it. I thought maybe I could use it for crafts or something, but yeah, I think this was like three something it was less than four dollars but anyway I found this at Walmart okay the next thing I found at TJ Maxx was this Coco and Lola cake stand and this was $12.99 that's what it looks like this is the packaging that it came in and you could of course see the pink plates here but that's the packaging and I had already put it together and here's what it looks like here super cute all right next couple things I picked up two packs of these because I thought they were really cute. These are just some uh, blank note cards and envelopes. What's the brand here? Graphique. Oh, Graphique. I love that brand. That's like the same brand that does like the vintage Barbie cards and stuff like that. Um, but anyway, they look like this. They just say thank you in pink and they got the pretty leopard print. Um, and then the envelopes look like that. These were $3.99 each and like I said, I picked up two packs. You get 16 cards and 16 envelopes in each. Okay, next random thing um, are these barrettes. These are $7.99. I thought these were really pretty. You get three barrettes and two bobby pins, but they look like this. Super blingy and sparkly. There's a pink, a white, and like a gunmetal kind of gray color. And then, I don't know if you guys can tell, but these little gems are kind of like iridescent on the bobby pins but yeah those were $7.99 thought those were really pretty I needed a pair of exfoliating gloves so of course I found a nice pretty pink pair from TJ Maxx these were only $3.99 and I'm glad that these came with two because sometimes you can only find like one glove um but I like to have them on both hands that way I can you know scrub both both arms both sides of my body I came across this Dr. Jart Peeling Solution Tok Tok Peeling Bubble Mask. Um, it says it's a peeling mask that makes skin feel purified and fresher. Oh, it's a two-step type of thing. Okay, I see here. So the top part of this is a peeling essence, and the bottom part is the pH balancing mask. Okay, so that's what it looks like here. And then this top half here, you rip that, and that's step one. And then this bottom half is step two. And this was $3.49. Like I said, it's Dr. Jart. I've heard really good things about Dr. Jart. I've never tried anything from them. But I was definitely excited to give this a try. All right, some makeup wipes. These are both from the Cream Shop. I actually really like the Cream Shop wipes. Um... So this first pack I have are Hydrate and Balance. They are Clear the Way 60 Count Pre-Wet Cleansing Towelettes. Goodbye Oil Dirt Waterproof Makeup. Um, these are just the rose water wipes. You get 60 wipes in a pack. Pretty pink packaging. And these were $3.99 for those. And then this next pack is... Um, watermelon and Hyaluronic Acid Power Fusion Cleansing. And these are also refresh and hydrate. Also 60, uh, 60 wipes and then these are also $3.99. So these are pretty mint green and pink packaging. I'm excited to give these a try. Okay, another cream shop item are these Precision Grip Facial Hair Razors. Um, these ones are different from ones I've seen like ever seen before. I thought these were these looked really interesting. But they look like this. They come with two little razors. So if, I don't know if you guys can see, but the razors are right here on each side. And like I said, these are also by the cream shop or the creme shop, however you want to say it. These were $3.99. Last two things in this bag are all beauty related, of course. First thing here is a perfume I was so excited to come across this because out of the two scents that she has this one is definitely my favorite this is the Saint perfume by Kat Von D 
This was $12.99. But I thought this bottle was super pretty. And I kind of like the fact that it doesn't have like any writing on it. It's just like... I don't know it's just really clean and classy looking it's really pretty um and this smells really good i can't even describe it like i want to say it's it's some it's a little florally but it's more fresh it smells really nice okay another pretty vulgar item i had to pick up um because you know this packaging alone was adorable as well this is the ink gel eyeliner from pretty vulgar this was $7.99. And I just love the packaging of this. It's like a little inkwell. Like back in the day, you know, when those they used to like dip their pens in ink and write that way. But isn't that cute? Like I can't wait to just set some of this stuff out on my vanity. Next thing I have is a Beauty Bento Bouncy Matte and Shimmer Eyeshadow Trio from Kaja. This was $3.99. I was on the hunt for these and sadly this was the only one I ever came across. I've been back maybe three or four times since I found this one and haven't seen anything else since. Um, but this is so cute. Um, and the fact that this was $3.99 when these are originally $21. $21 for this. Can you guys believe it? But anyway, this one is in the shade Chocolate Dahlia. If you guys aren't familiar, it, it's just this little stack of eyeshadows. So you open, there's the bottom one, it's a nice brown color, nice tan there, and then the top. So they're really, really cute, and I really wish I would have found more of these, but oh well, I'll keep an eye out. Still a bunch more of things to go here. Um, I had to pick up this adorable little Kapari Coconut Body Glow because look at how cute and mini this is, you guys. Even if it's just going to set on my vanity because it's a little pink packaging. It's so cute. Um, this was $2.99 for this little thing. And this smells really good too. But this is just, I guess this is just, you know, to give you a nice, a nice uh, body glow. I don't think it's really supposed to, I don't think it really has any like skincare benefits to it or anything like that. But like I said, the packaging was just too cute to pass up. Okay, next thing I have here is a loose pigment from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And this is in the shade Daiquiri. The packaging looks like this. This was $5.99. And I'll take it out of the packaging so you guys can see it better. And I like the white packaging too. It's really pretty. But hopefully you guys can see. It's like a really pretty, like, almost like a rose gold pinky kind of color. Like shimmery color really really pretty so definitely excited to have that in my collection okay and the last two things in this bag are MAC lipsticks these were both $7.99 each I have these in this shade uh, coffee and cigs which is like this nice kind of brown color and then this one is bated breath which is kind of like a, a brick red kind of color I don't know which is kind of weird though because I feel like the packaging itself doesn't match the color so you can see it's kind of like a purpley fuchsia color but then there is the lipstick color itself and this one is bated breath <clears throat> and i just love the smell of mac lipsticks okay and then this one you can see the packaging doesn't really match that one either this one is coffee and cigs and this one is kind of a darker brown than the last one but these are really pretty and I'm excited to have these in my collection. Okay, a couple clearance items I came across I was super excited about. My store had actually received a ton of these. And I, you know, wasn't really ever interested in it at full price. Because full price it was like uh, $19.99. But when I saw that they marked it down to $7, I was like, you know what, what the heck. You know, if anything, if I just leave it in the packaging and just, like, put it out as decor around Christmas time, like, under my Christmas tree or something, I think that would look really cute. But this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Loose Glitter Kit. It comes with five glitters and a glitter adhesive. Let me go ahead and pull these out. Um, and, you know, like, just looking at these with the naked eye, they all look like the same color. Like, they all look like the same glitter to me. But if you look on the back here, I guess with the adhesive, 
this is what each of the glitters will look like. So it comes with the shades Snowfall, Glisten, Frosted, Mistletoe, and Jolly. So yeah, so it says when applied, iridescent glitters appear. Okay, the next awesome clearance find, um, actually the next two, are some hair styling tools, which I was really excited to find because I needed some new ones of these. Um, but this first one is a Fahrenheit hair care system heat wave, uh, one and a quarter inch flat iron, and this is in the color blush pink. This was on clearance for $12.00. And I peeled the sticker off and it was originally only uh, $16.99 but I had looked these up on Amazon to like see like try to like see what reviews and stuff were and these were like $50 or more like um, and the reviews were all pretty decent so anywho let me just open it up and show you guys but here is what the straightener looks like it's it's looking more purple on camera but it's a really pretty like metallic Barbie pink it's really pretty and then this next product I found was also on clearance. This was originally $29.99. Um, I got this for $10. And this is from the brand Foxy Bay. This is the Rose Gold and Marble 32mm Curling Wand. <laughs> Alright, next thing I came across was this uh, compact organizer. They only had one of these or else I would have probably liked to grab a couple. Um, but this was $6.99. And it just looks like this. Um, and I don't know if you can tell, but like the bottom is rose gold. Probably can't really tell on camera, but along the inside on the bottom is rose gold. And then of course the rest is clear acrylic or plastic. Um, but yeah, I th thought this would be cute. I might leave this out. Um, I don't think I'm going to use this in my drawers. I want I got this more to leave it out so I can put some cute you no know, makeup products in here on display. Um, so yeah, that's why I got that. Okay, next item I picked up. I thought this was really pretty. Um, this was $5.99. This is from the brand Spa Life. This is a hyaluronic pearl serum, hydrate and glow. And like, just look at it guys. Like, how pretty is that going to be just sitting on my vanity? Like, the, the pink little pearls in there. So cute. And this was $5.99. Okay, and the last few items were pretty much the main reason I went into TJ Maxx today. Was it today? This morning? And I ended up, you know, with a bunch of this other stuff. But I was in the in need of some new shampoo and conditioner because the stuff I've been using is this, it's just not, it's just not doing it for my hair. So... I wanted to give this one a try. I've seen the shampoo by itself a few times at TJ Maxx and I went, I was just going to get that today and you know just buy a random conditioner but luckily I turned around and saw they had a whole shelf of these duo packs. Anyway let me show you guys what I'm talking about but this is the Coco Magic Ultra Hydrating Duo, um, the shampoo and conditioner. I don't know if you can tell, tell, tell. I don't know if you can tell, but the bottles are very pale pink. Let me go ahead and actually take them out of the packaging. This was a little bit of a better deal because this was $16.99 for the, the, for the pack. But to buy them separately, you would have paid $8.99 each. So, you know, you save a dollar by buying the pack. But here's what the bottle looks like. A nice big 32-ounce bottle. It's got the nice pump with the gold accents. I just thought it was really pretty but it says it's infused with hair strengthening coconut oil and botanical extracts deeply hydrates and restores shine it's paraben free and non-greasy so I don't know I couldn't find a whole lot about this brand online but what I did find people seem to really like it and it smells really nice and then I also to go along with those I came across the coconut oil hair mask by the same brand Coco Magic this was $5.99 and it just looks like this and I'm excited to give this a try as well because this is like almost the consistency of like Vaseline I don't know if you guys can see like how thick and emollient that is but my hair oh it smells really good too um, my hair really needs some moisture so I'm really excited to give this system a try and see how that works out for my hair but who I think you guys I think we made it through everything that I wanted to show you in this random haul. 
<sighs> I do have a Dollar Tree haul that I'm going to film right after this one and then I do have a all pink makeup haul that I would like to film for you guys as well too fairly soon so keep an eye out for those videos um, I do want to apologize again for being gone so long but you guys know like I upload when I can when I'm feeling up to it hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and saw some things you were interested in and I hope you can find those things if you are interested in any of these items and I'm glad to be back and I've missed you guys and I thank you all for you know sticking around and staying subscribed and not giving up on me and I will hope to see you guys very soon in another video. Bye guys.